For Josh Kettle, it hardly seems like work. From May through October, he is a river guide on Colorado's Gunnison River, piloting an inflatable raft through the Gunnison Gorge Wilderness, located in the heart of the 63,000-acre Gunnison Gorge National Conservation Area. It's so beautiful, and it's, you know, it's one of a kind. There's no other canyon like it in the United States. It's just very wild, rugged. Uh, you know, the river is just amazing. Tons of fish, wildlife, just a great way to relax. Gold medal trout fishing beneath sheer granite cliffs, white water, wildlife, and spectacular vistas. Gunnison Gorge exists as it has for millennia. Unlike its neighbor to the east, Black Canyon of the Gunnison National Park, Gunnison Gorge is remote and undeveloped. Getting here is not easy, but it does have its benefits. You know, it takes enough planning and a little bit of effort that I think it keeps it from getting overcrowded. The fact that you can go for hours and hours and hours and not see any man-made construction, any other uh, uh, power lines or these kind of things or roads running through here, it's truly a canyon that hasn't changed in eons. Rafting and fishing the inner gorge of the Gunnison River is just one of many options for outdoor recreation within the conservation area. This area was designated as multi-use public land. It's a true Colorado playground, offering easy access activities as well. ATVing, horseback riding, mountain biking, hiking, plus fishing, and if they bring a boat, throw in a boat as well. Miles of single track trails and jeep roads enable virtually every mode of transportation within the gorge boundary, and more routes are currently under construction. The new Sidewinder trail system will enable visitors to transect nearly the entire conservation area with several options for smaller loops. Regulations segregate users to prevent conflict and to enhance the outdoor experience. And that's what we hear the most of people come out here and they say, this place is only 63,000 acres, but it feels much bigger when you have the opportunity to explore it in a whole lot of different ways. The gorge was added to America's National Landscape Conservation System 10 years ago, a system that has blossomed and flourished through the efforts of grassroots citizens groups and volunteers. The idea is to forever protect landscapes that have outstanding natural, cultural, and historical value from development or encroachment. Gunnison is a great example of that. This gorge is, is going to remain wild for future generations, and I think people generations from now are going to look back at this and be really glad that our generation helped keep this place wild and kept it like it is. For This American Land, I'm Bruce Burkhardt.